and welcome to a Greek mythology inspired wave survival game named Legendary Hoplite. We're going to be getting a look in on it today, starting off with a tutorial where we'll get a little backstory. So, villager. Help! Help us, please! The skeletons have already killed so many villagers! Captain, a stranger is approaching with a weapon in hand. Blow the horn! Prepare for battle! Alright, and here we are. The enemies are going to attack us in waves, and we can move around to defend ourselves try and throw some spears, but that's not all. Once we get a few of these skeletons down, we will gain access to a new troop. The Phalanx, a spear-wielding soldier. And here we go, press 1, and I can throw it on any of these lines here. We'll just start off right in the middle, how about that? And enemy soldiers come in, the spearmen. Those look a bit more like swords they're holding. Oh, on the right side, spearmen, of course. I've been fighting sword-wielding skeletons already. We'll leave the middle to our spearmen. Get rid of a few of them for me while I take care of these spearmen enemies. And I've got a decent amount of mana there. Okay, we can do all in the middle here to fight these first set of troops while I take care of the ones coming in after them. Nice! Soldiers are doing a great job, all their bones littering the field. How about we throw in an extra on this side, we'll attack the other. Just guard the whole right side as soon as I can while I protect the left. Come on, come on. There we go. Soldiers all on the right side. Excellent. Although, yeah, I don't know if they can hold out. Captain, save us! Only prayers to the gods can help us through these tribulations. Oh, Supreme Zeus, we beseech you to save us. Why did you go out here? No gods would save us now. Foolish villager. <laughs> oh, <laughs> well, apparently gods will save us. Gaia has arrived! Young captain, you do not believe in gods, do you? Who are you? I am Gaia, the mother of all things. Zeus, the god who you pray to, is only one of my descendants. By the grace of the gods! <laughs> Could you tell me more about these things that are invading us? Skeleton soldiers come from the underworld, the land of Hades. They attack Ithaca for a purpose. It's not just an invasion. The attacks will continue and become more and more dangerous each time. They'll spread through the whole of Ithaca. These are just scouting soldiers. Why are you helping us? Oh. I love every living thing on this earth, all equally. I would not get involved in any manner if it followed the laws of nature. These skeleton soldiers don't belong to this world. All right, well, I get the point then. Oh. Yes. Oh. Mm. Mm. Here has four types of equipment. Helmet, spear, sword, shield. Every equipment has its own skill. Launch five spears forward in a fan shape. Whereas this old one had twin spears. Two spears at once, both dealing 300% weapon damage. The new one has better attack damage, it looks like. Works for me. Let's travel in to our next area. We better hurry up and prepare for the next enemy assault. Sounds good to me. We gotta get ourselves some of this mana, essentially. Oh wait, mana... Is this... This is energy, and I guess this is combat points, right? Q to cast the spear skill. Boom. Okay, took a couple of them out. These guys have a decent block on them. <laughs> a little harder to get through there. Boom. There we go. Press space to call the next wave sooner, getting me extra combat points and stamina. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, okay. Well, two is good enough. Next one. Boom. Boom. There we go. All of our lines are full. Can they stand behind each other and attack or no? Okay. Oh yeah, it looks like they might be able to attack from behind each other. Then let's stack up on these ones. It's better to have two people attacking if I can. I should probably be using my skills a little bit more. <laughs> I'm wasting energy, I suppose. But we already win, so early, early levels, not too big of a deal. Right, what do we got? Upgrade your hero to your preference, and I can reset for free. Great. And a new troop as well. <laughs> Strength increases my attack damage in a variety of ways. Agility, okay. Attack speed, critical chance, evasion and block chance for myself. Endurance to increase stamina or leadership. To increase combat points. That one feels like the most important one. Eventually I'm gonna need these troops to be really powerful. They're gonna become stronger than I am. So let's invest in our troops. And we got a new one, Barrel Thrower. We'll take a look at it in the new area. Captain, I just received a report that our southern outpost has been attacked by skeleton soldiers and our troops were at a disadvantage. That area is quite densely populated with citizens. Well, tribulation has begun to spread all over Ithaca. Goddess Gaia was right. The situation here is stable for the time being. You will hold the gates in my stead until there is an order from the Hand Eumius. Eumus, now I shall depart to bring the news of the goddess Gaia and help the southern outpost. Yes. Yes. Prepare yourselves. Nice. Free troops at the beginning. And we'll throw one over here. Oop. Okay, there's quite a lot there. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> there we go. Oh, wow, that's nice. Select troop with two. Throw. Boom. Okay. I can appreciate that. Press space. Start the new wave and let's let's put down extra soldier there. Boom, boom. Boom. 
I should probably double up on soldiers more so than uh, spread them out. So we'll wait on this last row. We'll start doubling up instead. Skills unlocked. W and E. Oh, yeah, I don't think I put on the new weapons. I think I got new weapons. Oops. <laughs> All right, wild thrusts and shield throw. Cool. I like that one. Wild thrusts. W? Oh, okay, that... That's for when the enemy gets close, I suppose. Okay, they've got archers. Let's throw a shield in there. That seems like a good option. Shield throw costs 35, but it's a ranged attack, which is really cool. Let's put another guy in here. Oh, we gotta get rid of these archers quick. Cool. There we go. That really worked. You probably can't triple up soldiers. I'm assuming not. The spear probably allows them to attack two forward, but probably not three forward. That'd be a little bit silly. Boom. Shield. Oh. New skill unlocked with R. Letting me throw real fast. Cool. <laughs> okay, my guy finally got winded after all this time. I'm not really one to use barrel type weapons, these uh, single use weaponry. I'm not a big fan generally. Ooh, Cyclops. Okay, that might be a time to use the barrel though. They might get really bunched up there. Okay, R. Okay, you have no place here. okay uh, Cyclops is a problem. Barrel time. Okay, did that do anything? <laughs> Maybe not really. So the shield, try to get rid of the archers in the back. Um, speed myself up and put down some more soldiers. <laughs> oh boy. Come on, get him down. Shield again. Uh oh. Archers there, get rid of them. Yes, finally they're down. Boom. There we go. Okay, that was a little bit, little bit rocky in the middle there, but came around at the end. We got a lot of weapons. Gotta make sure I put them on this time. Look at this guy's voice be. Mm. The enemy is attacking with increasing numbers and strength. Captain, I think you should upgrade the army before going to the next battle. Yes, please guide me. All right, new troop, barricade. Now we're talking. Put some spearmen behind it. Can I put two behind it or just one? Not sure. So I can use coins to upgrade troops. First, we got to put on our gear though. Don't want to forget that. And we got an extra point. Throw that in leadership. Starting combat points. Gets us some early, early characters out there. Mm, what's the best one? This one seems like it. This gives you War Cry. Bellows to all enemies in the battlefield, reducing their physical resistance by 10% and cold resistance by 30%. Cold resistance? I do kind of like War Cry. So let's, let's, uh, okay, we can sell these other hats here. Yeah, we can just sell all this excess equipment. I don't think I need it. Give us some extra gold so I can maybe invest into something here. Build a new palisade on the existing one. So if this one loses HP, I can replace it. That sounds kind of good. We got block chance or we have attack speed and evasion chance. So if I can't put these guys behind some barricades, maybe that'll be really good. Let's try that out. And already we are building to something interesting. Okay. Ooh, I want to put this in front of these guys. Yeah, put these guys behind some barricades. And I, oh, let me also put two on this one and see if they can double attack there. Guys in front do, guys in back do not. Okay, so only one behind barricades, that's fine. So what if then I sent some guys in and put them in front of the barricade and then I put, uh, I put barricades behind them. If they beat my front guys, then they can face the guys behind. Mm, no, that doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Barricades are cheaper than soldiers. So barricades are better to maybe put first. But I think a pretty normal escalation from here is at some point to get archers. So once I have archers, then I can really go for this. Ooh, they're getting in close. Come on, get rid of these guys. There you go, okay. We'll put down barricades all along it, for starters. Send our next wave in. Put down soldiers behind barricades all along it. And then I just have to kind of deal with enemies as they come in. Let's try that roar. Okay, they're all running back. Wow, okay, I didn't realize it did that. <laughs> That's really useful. Throw a barrel out there. And then that. Jeez, they're really... These guys have so much block. Oh. Put down the barricade. Put down more soldiers. And then I can't replace this barricade. That would be a really good upgrade to have. I do understand now. <laughs> so many skeletons, so many wolves. These archer skeletons are the most annoying. I need to get my own archers. Oh yeah, I'm kind of stacking up my combat points. Oh, rock thrower. Direct damage to the gate. Devours all enemy HP that it damages or something. Okay, let's let's really try to push out some damage on him. War cry. What does W do again? Ah, uh, I hate that. Oh yeah, I don't want that. Yeah, my guy's almost, almost exhausted at this point. Let's just exhaust them get myself down for a second and we're gonna put down soldiers throw barrel put that down okay boom come on get this guy down oh he stunned me oh no okay arc get him back 
There we go. Okay, that got kind of close. That guy was, that guy was real tough. I like that I can sell the equipment though. Let's me get a lot of extra gold. All right, we got a new troop. The archer, it looks like. Excellent. I honestly, I don't like the barrel. Can I put him back? <laughs> so let's just put him at the end. How about that? Mm. Upgrade to increase attack speed and range. Maybe we go with archery. Focus in on that, and then sell this so that we can get the palisade upgrade because that seems. But Palisade Upgrade just means I can replace it before it can fall down. I don't know if that's as useful as a stronger Phalanx. So, yeah, we'll keep this one like it is. Okay, that should be fine. Let's keep going. Oh, uh, get myself more points in leadership. Recurring Throw. Rolls the shield from the hero's position to a certain point and then rolls back. Let's try that one out then. Auto Cast. Decisive Throw. Enhances every next spear, increasing evasion break by 35%, block break, and dealing extra damage. That's crazy. So just makes me stronger, kind of. I'll do the Rusty Spear. Because it'd be good to break through those blocks they have. All right, here we go. I wish I could... Oh, I don't like having these here. These archers are not what I was hoping for. I guess they're free, though, so that's good. Maybe put archers um, over here. Okay, tons of archers in the back. I'm not sure if, if the phalanx guys will stop me from putting archers down. I want to make sure I get the archers down. Okay. Cool, like that. Let's do that. Now we put in barricades. Boom, like that. Oh, that just goes a little bit of a ways. That does that, sh <laughs> that shield only goes so far. Okay, maybe that shield's not as useful then. Put down soldiers. I can let them break into this a little bit. Because I just I don't want these frontline archers. Barricades, soldiers. Where's archers? Can I still put that down? Oh I can't. Uh, soldiers are there. Yeah, it does work that way. Okay. Let's put a bunch of barricades down. Some archers. Let's let's let our our, uh, our stamina come back. Put down all the archer towers we can. There we go. Archer towers are in. All of them that I can have. Nice. And then we just throw down soldiers. Ghosts. High physical resistance, slow nearby enemies. That'll be fine. What if I put an extra soldier on this? How many soldiers can I have on a tower? <laughs> Let's just keep putting soldiers then. It will mean that I probably can't put the barricade down, though, if this gets broken. Let's let us let this break. Unless they break it down. <laughs> they might finish that guy off, yeah, just before he breaks it. On. Keep going, soldier. You got us. You got this. Just one attack. One attack is all you need to make. Boom. Yes. Okay, they all come out. And now I can't put down a barricade with that many soldiers lined up. <laughs> Look at all these soldiers. Okay, that's as many as I can have. Flee. <laughs> Look at this guy. Stands no chance at all. Little little bullets hitting him. They don't do very much damage, unfortunately. I need the towers to be a little bit stronger. We got some new weaponry. And that will help. If nothing else, I can sell it and get myself some stronger gear. Ooh, catapult? Only four types of troops can be brought into the battlefield. Okay. So I already know what I want to do then. <laughs> the weird thing is, I think I can't put an archer tower down if there are people there, but I can put people there if there's an archer tower down. Probably going to try the stone thrower out. Maybe we sell archer and just go stone thrower from now on. Barricade upgrade. Palisade. You can build on top of it. And then the next one, model architecture. Row of stakes supporting each other. The longer the row, the higher the HP bonus. I always have them in a row. What if I sell this by this next one? 190. What does that do for me? Every new adjacent palisade connected on a horizontal line gets 5% maximum HP bonus. There are, I think, seven lines. So 35% HP up. Works for me. Our scouts reported that the enemy general has entered the battle. Perhaps this is a covert assault to capture our barracks. Beware, Captain Dio. This could be your biggest fight ever. Oh, wait. His voice. Uh, yes, strategist. I'll protect Ithaca with my life. All right. I forgot to do the voice for that guy, but it is what it is. Maybe upgrade ourselves again. Leadership up. And one more time, and we get access to good leader. Reduce combat point requirements of the army by 7%. That's really good. Spectral shield. Create three shields, which pre prevent enemies from stepping further for 11 seconds. 11 seconds is a lot. But let's try out the large shield and see what that does. Long sword, sword eruption. Okay, swords come up out of the ground and deal some damage for me. Penetrating spear. We throw a spear that uh, hurts some enemies. Storm of arrows. Call reinforcements to rain down a storm of arrows. Wow. Okay, we'll try that one as well. What do we want to start with? So no initial uh, starting help here. Barricade, barricade, and the catapult. These are expensive, I see. Let's face the next wave. we got to do it to be able to afford more. Um, I put down an archer tower instead of a instead of a catapult there. That's fine. We'll, we'll put down two archer towers on this one, then. Lost a little HP for the first time. W. Is that there? 
Oh, that was nice. Run some soldiers there. Jeez, they are breaking through that fast. But my basic attack seems really good. Like, let these guys get in close, and then I can just really hammer them like that. Um, put soldiers here. Wow, we are struggling a tiny, tiny bit here for sure. And soldiers, this is the one, like, this is all I need for this whole row. Three, two, and one. There we go. Nice. Okay, that, that puts this whole side up. Let's try using E here. Three shields. They go here. Okay, so they get up to this and then they stop moving. That's not bad. I don't think it's as useful as the shield throw, though, because that does a good amount of damage, so it has a lot more use to it. Get rid of these guys. Three, two, one. How much do I need to do three, two, one? 223 plus 84, we're say around 300. Uh, 310 or so. And then add in, or 307, right? Th add in 102, so 405. We need at least 405 points to do a 3 2 one. Three, two, one. There you go. I honestly, I might have done the math wrong there in my head, but <laughs> I don't want to have archers anymore. I just want to replace everything with just three, two, ones. Next wave, send them in. Oh, crap. Three, two, one. Gosh dang, I wasted a lot of extra combat points. I didn't realize I had so many. Okay, so let's let's see if I if I put one more guy in here. Gets red on the way through, and then, okay, clears. So we definitely can use the catapult with two people, but I think three might stop the catapult from being used. Okay, now we have this big guy. R throws out some arrows in a line. Let's see if that'll be enough to get rid of you. Can't tell this guy's health bar. Can't see any health bar at all. Okay. Got him down. Nice. Okay, there we go. Three, two, one. And then two, one here. Okay. Let this thing break, finally. It's a little bit spooky, though, because as soon as they come through, I need to replace it. Yes, okay. Come on, let me replace this. Yes. One. Send more in. Come on. Boom. R. Can't use that yet. Q, then. Boom. Yes, got him down. Ooh, these guys have long spears, so they're not actually getting attacked by my soldiers at all. That's not good. Get there. Boom, boom. Place. Good. Keep these catapults up. Soldiers there. Barricades up. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're holding out. So now we wait. Let our stamina recover. How are these guys doing? They're doing fine. We'll replace the barricade there early. I know it's a little bit expensive for that, but I honestly, yeah, I can just let my catapults take care of these guys for the most part, I hope. Next wave. How are we doing? Let's put in two behind each if I can. So I'm using up some of that extra combat point. Ajax, the irony. I went through life and death with your father in the Trojan War. Now I have to fight his son. Perhaps you're mistaken. My father was a herder who had never seen a day of war. I am not wrong. You're the spitting image of your father in appearance, mannerism, and voice. My father and I have no such thing in common as he said. Ah, uh, perhaps I've said too much. I'll let my sword do the talking instead. You, move aside or die. I have chosen death ever since I put on this armor. All right, well, we'll see what you can do then. I don't know with all of this defenses if you can handle me. We will see. Oh, okay. Um, don't think I want to land in that uh, flame area. Thank you very much. Uh, some of this and uh, some of this. Arrows. Quickly. <laughs> Just keep regenerating. I think this might be one where I have to last out. Oh, wait. Does he have a health bar? I think he might have a health bar. Okay. We gotta do some damage to him then. Okay, what can we do here? Ooh, that hurts. <laughs> that is not good. Oh, if he destroys that catapult, that's not good. Not good at all. We are slowly chunking his armor down, but not by enough. Ooh, okay. Oh, I don't have... I don't know if I can do this one. Oh, he's got a lot of health left. So much health. I only got a quarter of his health down, and I'm already completely in shambles. Just dish some damage out to him. I want to see how much I can do, Max. I'm assuming if I can beat him, it would end. Okay, throw some, get some arrows going that way. Slow them down. It's not going to happen. Come on, get these guys down. Let me through. I must damage him. No. <laughs> you need to try harder to surpass your father's glory. You don't know my father. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I got a little bit stronger. I've got him up to halfway health, but I think I think I'm still doomed. Wait, hold on. I somehow am actually doing pretty good, I think. 
I've almost got him, actually. This is kind of shocking. I was not expecting this. Just let myself take a little damage on the right side. Don't worry about that. Hmm. Okay. I know I've got to get out of the way there. I would have been very proud of you. So am I. <laughs> no way. I can't believe I won. So strange. Even in death, he is still talking about my father. There would be no red flowers growing this time. Whatever that means. Okay, look at that. Points. Gold. <laughs> Why is it so much? Honestly, like, I didn't talk at all for most of that match, so... But I really wasn't expecting to win there. I was mostly just trying to get some extra gold, some extra weapons. Uh -huh. Range damage is super cool. Ooh. I want to invest in something crazy like this. Oh, man. We're gonna, we're gonna reset some things so we can afford this. Let's try the one that shoots a ton of small stones. There was a catapult option where it's probably some huge stone, but a ton of small stones, will they be able to shoot between rows? That's what I really want to see. It's looking cool. What the heck? Don't do that. <laughs> Get down! Shoot, yes. There we go. Hmm. I maybe would rather have the catapult then. I was really hoping this one would kind of hit multiple rows, like multiple uh, columns. Um, <laughs> I have not been playing smart. So these guys want to just dodge around my, my palisades. That seems to be the problem here. Should also be using some abilities. Oh my gosh, that was cool. All right, so we got to explore after the boss, take a look at a new area, but I think I will probably leave this one here. If you guys are interested in seeing more of this game or seeing the full game when it comes out, be sure to let me know down in the comments. And either way, I hope you guys did enjoy this one. Be sure to leave a like or a comment to let me know if you did, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye now.